Once upon a time, two devoted sweethearts set out on a summer afternoon to enjoy the sunshine, the warm breeze, and the pleasure of each other's company. Mickey and Minnie were so happy that they were certain everyone must feel the same. <laughs> but alas, joy is not found in all hearts. Where there should be love and kindness, there is jealousy and anger. The witch, Miserable, had such a heart, one filled with darkness and envy. Oh, dear. Aw, it's OK, Minnie. I bet the sun will be back in a jiffy. Mickey's wish was not to be. The day turned to night, and the skies thundered with ill will and fury. Yikes! In the brief moment that Mickey closed his eyes against the bright flash of lightning, his happiness was shattered. Oh, Minnie! The evil witch Miserable had kidnapped Minnie. The old crone had always been jealous of the mouse's beauty. Now she would rob her of it. <laughs> Poor Mickey. You never appreciate what you have until it's gone. Isn't that right? No, no! And get her back! <laughs> As Miserable took to the skies with his beloved Minnie, Mickey knew he had to act fast. Oh, Mickey, save me! Running with all his might, he chased the witch through the forest. <laughs> Mickey scampered and scurried all the way to... the Castle of Illusion.
you are a match for me. Now that would be a castle of delusion. <laughs> Spectres from beyond the grave, heed my bidding, hear my call. Rid me of this earnest name. Crush his spirit, be his fall. Attack! You still don't realize what my castle of illusion is, do you, Mickey? It's a mouse trap. Return to me, my fiendish fools. Circle round ghosts and ghouls. Spin and twist, twirl and whirl. Let your phantom fury swirl. Strike! <laughs> dazed. But for how long? Suddenly, Mickey had an idea. What if he launched the rainbow gem at the witch? It might be his one and only chance. Take that! Time seemed to freeze for a moment, before the gem burst into a cascade of rainbow light, filling every inch of the tower. No! But I wanted to be the fairest of the world! It was the cruel witch's turn to be trapped and powerless, encased in the spreading light. The terrible spell was broken. Minnie was free at last, and Miserable wilted and shriveled back to her true form. Minnie threw her arms around Mickey, and as he hugged her, he vowed never to let her go again. Oh! The gym! The castle was crumbling, but Mickey couldn't see a way out. What was this? Miserable was helping them escape? Mickey didn't have time to consider if this was another trick. Ooh. Mickey and Minnie each held on to a broomstick and flew for their lives. <laughs> <laughs> Miserable had wisdom enough to know when she was defeated and why that was so. She had learned that there's a magic more powerful than any she had ever used. Mickey and Minnie knew it well, and even after what she had put them through, they shared its secrets with her. Now, Miserable's heart was filled with a different kind of magic, the magic of love. Aww. 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 <laughs> now, where were we? The end.
Wow! Look at this place! Mad Doc doesn't do anything small, does he? No, I guess he doesn't. So where is he anyway? Hey! What's happening? Look out! I didn't think you could make it through my defenses, but here you are. Prescott, stop these games this instant. Why did you sabotage the projectors? Why? I can do whatever I want, that's why. My brilliance was wasted at the Gag Factory. You wouldn't even listen to my plan to upgrade the projectors. With the brush, no one will ever look down their noses at me again. Behold, my greatest creation. <laughs> My 
what? Look at those! There's a force field below us! Looks like a nasty one, too. Quick! Knock back the cannonball! This one's mine! I'll distract it, and you fill up its tanks! Do this. I'll distract it, and you fill up its tanks. Oswald, once those tanks are full, reprogram them! This is... Well done, Oswald. The contents of the tanks are affecting that giant machine above us. Interesting. Mickey, you need to fill the turret with paint or thinner! Back the cannonball! Don't worry about it. I'll distract it and you fill up its tanks. I'll distract it and you fill up its tanks. This is mine. I'm all over it. Oswald, you can reprogram the turret from the side. My word. Look at the. One more time and that thing is toast. I'll distract it, and you fill up its tanks. Quick, knock back the cannonball! I'll distract it, and you fill up its tanks. I'm all over it. My word, look at those tanks on the machine's backside. Distract it, and you fill up its tanks. Yeah, I know how to do this. I'm all over it. Mickey, if you fill up the tanks, we can end this charade. I'll distract it, and you fill up its tanks. Don't worry about it. Look! It's reloading! We can get close! I'll distract it, and you fill up its tanks. It's reloading! We can get close! Yeah, I know how to do this! My word! Look at those tanks on the machine's backside! This is mine! Quick! Knock back the cannonball! Oswald, once those tanks are full, I'll distract it, and you fill up its tanks. Mickey! We did it! We defeated the turret! and you won't ruin it for me. And as for you, you big pile of bolts, remember who your master is. Ha! This 
is my creation, not your toy. And now he'll prove it. Attack! Quickly! Thin out the monster's armor and finish this! His armor is made of toon! That's his weakness, Mickey! Quickly! Thin out the monster's armor and finish this! His armor is made of toon! That's his weakness, Mickey! Aha! Fire the cannons, ye blooming cockroaches! <laughs> Projectile damage the panel! Don't worry about it. That did the trick! The projectile damaged the panels! Yeah, I know how to do this. Quickly! Thin out the monster's armor and finish this! His armor is made of toon! That's his weakness, Mickey! His armor is made of toon! That's his weakness, Mickey! Quickly! Thin out the monster's armor and finish this! An umbrella won't help you here! <laughs> I recognize these gears! Paint them in! And those big doors should close! This is mine. There's nothing to power, Mickey. You gotta paint in the gears. Machinery under these panels. We've got to break through. I'll send you back to Mean Street in a paint can. This one's mine. That did the trick. The projectile damaged the panel. There's nothing to power, Mickey. You gotta paint in the gears. I'm all over it. Made of tune! That's his weakness, Mickey! Ah! Button down the hatches! Quickly! Thin out the monster's armor and finish this! Quickly! Thin out the monster's armor and finish this! His armor is made of tune! That's his weakness, Mickey! Won't help you here. <laughs> that did the trick. The projectile damaged the panels. <laughs> ah! His armor is made of toon. That's his weakness, Mickey. Quickly! Thin out the monster's armor and finish this! Quickly! Thin out the monster's armor and finish this! His armor is made of toon! That's his weakness, Mickey! His armor is made of toon! That's his weakness, Mickey! Run away, little mouse! I recognize these gears. Paint them in, and those big doors should close. Ah! Button down the hatches! There's nothing to power, Mickey. You gotta paint in the gears. Quickly! Thin out the monster's armor and finish this. Quickly! Thin out the monster's armor and finish this. 
His armor is made of toon! That's his weakness, Mickey! Quickly, thin out the monster's armor and finish this! Ah! Button down the hatches, Mickey! <laughs> An umbrella won't help you here! <laughs> I recognize these gears! Paint them in, and those big doors should close! Huh? What's happening? What did you do? My masterpiece! No! <laughs> Your friends are... History. My ride will pull the Guardians out of Wasteland. Then everyone and everything will become inert. Your ridiculous friends included. Ah. And when I enter the cartoon world, I'll use the brush to become the greatest villain of all time! And you will help me. Give me the brush, and I'll set your friends and your precious guardians free. Refuse, and watch them turn inert, and I will destroy Wasteland! hit this monster the whole time. Wait until the eye opens, Mickey, and then spray it. Shock the hand, Oswald. That'll stun it. Ah, welcome, Mickey. Now I will crush you and the not-so-lucky rabbit. Look out. The hand is... You can't beat us both, Doc. Give it up. Don't let it grab you! I will find what lies beyond this bed. 
Attack and he is toast. When I have the brush, I will rule the cartoon world. Get him, Mickey. Attack the masks. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
choices, the brave mouse and the lucky rabbit prevailed against the machinations of the mad doctor. Mickey and Oswald did not know what challenges may lay ahead, but they were comforted by the knowledge that together they could conquer anything. Look at them all, so happy! They ain't never gonna know what hit them. <laughs>
Yeah. <laughs> 
Leo. Thank <laughs> you. 
big mistake. Of course, Mazzy. Are you okay? Mazzy! Who is this Mazzy? Why, you're Mazzy, Mazzy. Blood pluggers! My name is not Mazzy. Mm -hmm. What is it then? I am Drazor! Oh boy! <laughs> yes! Drazor! Master inventor, lord of all knowledge, creator of this workshop, and bringer of your imminent demise. Wait, Mazzy is Grazar? No, Grazar is Mazzy. Grazar is Grazar. Gee, I'm usually pretty good at name games, but this one's got me stumped. The time for talking has passed, but the effects of this thrashing will last a lifetime. He's attacking! Look out!
worse. That must have tuckered him out. Do you think it's over, Mickey? <gasps> <gasps> Thank you, my friends. You're welcome. Wait, what? Ah! <gasps> you broke the spell and freed me. <laughs> oh, I was under his control for eons, a prisoner in my own body. Under whose control? An evil little bookmite by the name of Toku. Toku? I'm assuming by your perfectly pitch perplexion that you met. Oh, we've met him all right. He tricked us into stealing all the tomes from Monoth, but we thought he was releasing you because you were evil. Me? Evil? <laughs> Heavens, no, I, I barely get angry about things. Although, I do not care for gazpacho soup. I just don't understand. Who would choose to consume cold soup? Huh? So you didn't attack the biome heroes, Forcing them to imprison you here? Well, I did. But Toku made me. You see, he was controlling my mind with that magical crown. Oh, gosh. And he put it on you when you were sleeping. No, I... Did he creep up from behind and plop it on your head? Not at all. I... <laughs> Please, stop. <sighs> I put it on myself. Oh. <gasps> Gasp! Obviously, I didn't know it had a mind control spell on it. I just thought it looked pretty. You're right there. It looked real nice on you. Oh, <laughs> thank you. So, who is Toku, really? I looked up his Tokupedia page, and it just says, Super Nice Guy, Leader of the Hokins, Highly Skilled Trombone Player. Believe it or not, Toku created Tokupedia himself. Uh -huh. What? Oh, uh, uh huh. Yeah. For years, Toku was my apprentice, and I thought my friend. It never crossed my mind he would turn on me. He never showed any of the resentment brewing within him. He acted as though he loved me, and I loved him back. A once in a lifetime kind of friendship. We even vacationed with each other's families. Oh, what a fool I was! Gee, so Toku was the evil mastermind all along. But why did he do it? I have no idea. By the time he showed his true self, I already had the crown on my head and I was not in my right mind. Well, we're gonna make it right. That's why we came here to defeat you and get the books back. Oh, I don't have them. You need to get to Toku. Find Toku! Find the books! Sorry to change the subject, but earlier in our journey, when you would appear to us, why did you say your name was Mazzy? Mazzy is the nickname Post Officer gave me when we were younger, and it stuck. Wow, Mazzy! She said it was because I was mad and sassy. Well, you certainly are that. <laughs> How come you didn't stop us from helping Toku? It's strange. I never truly knew what was happening with Monoth. And even myself. I knew it was me, but also uh, I didn't. Does that make sense? <laughs> yep. Okay, I was never fully present, you see? The version of me you met was the small part of my personality that my subconscious was able to project out of this workshop. What? We gotta find Toku! Yes. The workshop is still intact. That means he hasn't destroyed the tomes and absorbed their power yet. But he will at any moment. So we must hurry. Time waits for no one! Whew. Um... Oh... You know, we really need someone to let the other heroes know what's happening. Oh, yeah. That would be super helpful. Oh, okay. I can definitely do that. I should probably clear my name with them anyhow. The last time I saw them, we fought bitterly, so I bet they're dying to reconnect. And we'll go find Toku and stop him from destroying the tomes. Love the confidence. 
Before you go, I have something that might be helpful. <laughs> What's this? All I know is, when I created the tomes, I also wrote this down and stored it within my workshop. Wither, dismantle, implode, end. Beats me. Well, based on the rules of this world and its magic, I'm sure it will have a very specific and narrow use at some point. No hurry! Head to the top of my workshop. I expect you'll find Toku there. Good luck, my friends. And remember, the hands of time are ticking. Oh, the hands of time are always ticking. That's their job. Toku, stop whatever weird stuff you're doing now. Oh, hey, Mickey and friends. What are you guys doing here? Don't, oh, hey, Mickey and friends, what are you guys doing here? Us, we've come to get those tomes. Yeah, whatever it takes. Please, give us the books. No, no, wait, wait. I'm, uh, uh, um, I'm under a spell by Grazar. He's controlling my mind with this hat, see? The hat you just took off? Yes! No, no, a different hat. An, an invisible one. Underneath this one, a sub hat. That's a thing here. Okay, I've heard enough. Just give up, Toku. Grazar told us everything. Grazar's a liar? I'm not a bad guy. Okay, I mean, my fellow Hokans will back me up. Really? Where are they? Oh, yeah, um... I no longer had use for them, so I dismissed them all for being inferior. But listen, if they were here, you know, they'd vouch for me, so just hear me out, please. Oh, this should be interesting. At first, uh, all I wanted was to be included, a seat at the table, a, a chance to give input, to have my voice heard. And why shouldn't I? I'm smart. I've got great ideas. Maybe I went about this the wrong way, sure, but the only reason I did it was because my whole life I've been treated badly, ignored, not taken seriously. All on account of... I'm... Just because you're small doesn't mean you should mind control others and make them attack people. Or trick a group of friends into helping you take over the world. He's so misguided. It's so sad. Okay, fine. You don't buy my excuse. I don't care. You don't understand where I'm coming from anyway. <laughs> That's where you're wrong, Toku. Every day, every one of us has to dig down deep inside to find that little bit of heroism. For us, it was being brave enough to accept your mission, and then undertake all the dangers we faced. And when we found out you tricked us, well, we had to be courageous enough to admit we were wrong and work hard to undo what we'd done. But that's what being a hero is all about. Oh, Mickey, I'm so proud of you. Well, it was kind of sloppy, but I agree. I love you guys! <laughs> oh, give me a break, would ya? I never said I wanted to be a hero. I said I wanted to rule Monoth. And now, that's exactly what I'm gonna do. When I absorb the power of the tomes, all of Monoth will tremble before my mighty leadership! <laughs> Wow! Nice kick, Minnie! I'm sorry to say it, but that was very satisfying! Don't feel bad! If anything deserves a kick, <laughs> it's wanting to destroy the world! Yeah! I want to kick him too! Oh no! Toku started the spell already! The tomes are breaking apart! <gasps> Uh-oh! I'm the one shot too! What are we gonna do, Mick? Okay, 
Paper! It's just those four words. Wither, dismantle, implode, and end. Mickey, those are words each biome uses to mean stop. Maybe it'll stop the spell. That's brilliant, Minnie. Well, let's say them together really loud. Wither, dismantle, implode, end! Him. It's still falling down! Now let's grab those books and get out of here! <laughs> and once the crown had been destroyed, it was as if the clock rolled back. Bam! I was good old me again. Emphasis on good. All this time it was Toku. I am sorry we doubted you, old friend. And that we wailed mercilessly upon thy backside. It's like I always say, the past has passed. So, let's present a good future. You never say that. Ah, you got me. <laughs> but it's good, right? Actually, it's great. I'd even put it on a t-shirt. <gasps> My friends! Were we victorious? Did you retrieve the tomes? Razor, as far as adventures go, this was one for the books. <laughs> I'm sad! Oh, thank you, my literary heroes. Now that you got the tomes back, are you going to separate them again? Or will you try to complete your experiments? We must learn from the past, or we are doomed to repeat it. What my philosophical friend is trying to say is, we will do neither. Exactly! We tried those approaches and both worked about as well as a goat on a stepladder. <laughs> goat on a stepladder? Of course! So, what will you do? Mm -hmm. These books are best preserved in the hands of heroes. Real heroes. Oh, gosh! While your execution may have, at times, been flawed... Flawed! That's us! <laughs> your intentions were always good. You may not have been the heroes these poems were created for, but you are the ones they need. Gosh, thanks! We're honored! I agree, but... Hooray! What's going to happen with Toku? I know with the portal closed, he's stuck, but I can't help thinking that he's plotting his next evil scheme. Be cool, be cool. Okay, so my plan wasn't quite as flawless as the simulations predicted, but how was I to know recruiting Mickey and his friends would backfire spectacularly? <laughs> I mean, I will be the first to admit we are all equally to blame for this. Toku will have a lot of time to ponder the error of his ways. Thank you again for your help. <laughs> we would love for you to stay a bit longer. I'm sure Manoth has plenty of secrets to discover. And who doesn't love secrets? <laughs> Goodbye. Thank you for everything, my friends. <laughs> Without you, I would have been history. Well, I had best depart. I just learned I have a Tokopedia page, and oh my, does it need updating! <laughs> it says I was born in North Monoth! <laughs> North Monoth! Of all the things! <laughs> I was born in East Monoth! Can you believe the internet would get something so wrong? Try being in a celebrity relationship. I can't imagine. <laughs> oh, before I go... Um, uh, uh, <laughs> Ta-da! The picnic! Now that's a callback. Is it a little over the top? Uh huh? 
I think it's a great monument to our friendship. Well, when you put it that way. Thank you, Grazar. It's lovely. Now, I must go. Time waits for no one. Are you sure? This picnic looks perfect for sharing. Hey, you said it, Minnie. And what better way to spend time than with your friends? Well, who am I to argue with time? Hot dog! <laughs> 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 